I just talked to the super cute shuttle driver, and he said that he just ran his last trip for tonight, so you're gonna have to catch an Uber. What? I mean, he can't just come back? Well, I almost had him convinced, but the manager of this crappy place just took away his keys. <laughs> oh, and he did mention that you have to go across the street to the parking garage for the Uber pickup area. Okay, I'll see you soon, hopefully. Okay, bye, boo. I'm sorry, can I help you? I didn't mean to startle you. It's just I'm worried about you. You shouldn't be out here by yourself. Right? I was starting to feel a little nervous. I, I thought I heard something strange coming from over there. Are you headed home? Actually, I just missed the last shuttle to my hotel. I was about to call an Uber. I was waiting for someone who didn't show, so I'm free. Let me give you a ride. Oh, um, no, thank you. I just, I couldn't inconvenience you like that. Oh, come on. Us trolley dollies have to stick together, right? Well, um, if you're sure, I wouldn't be too much of an inconvenience. Oh, come on. Give me somebody to talk to on the ride. Put your stuff in the back. Okay. Um, I think that was the turn for the arrow log. Yeah, we're not going to your hotel. We're going to my hotel. Oh, it's nothing like that. I just, I know the manager, and I'm gonna get you set up in a nice suite. What airline do you work for? Oh, well, that's a very fun story. And I'm gonna tell it over drinks on me. <laughs> I used to be just like you. Overworked, underappreciated, and dirt poor. Thanks, Mikey. Keep the change. But those days seem to be behind me. I can see that. What changed? I met a man, but not like that. Um, no, not a kept woman, far from it. We're uh, business partners. Must be some business. We like to think so. It's a private airline. I heard those jobs are hard to come by. Well, they can be if you're an average woman. But you don't strike me as average. <laughs> and our company is far from average. Franklin's philosophy was to keep a small base of the most discerning clients. We don't go looking for them. They come looking for us. How do you manage that? Every one of our flight attendants is also a concierge, extending not just to the flight, but the entire trip abroad. A concierge, so you like help them with dinner reservations? You make sure the clients are happy and comfortable, whatever they need. And they're very generous if treated right. In fact, some girls are asked to go on destination dates. Destination dates? You mean like? I think you know what I mean. So are you ready to go to the next level? 